Hey everybody, it's Jenny Hampson Lane, digital marketer, course creator, and KDP obsessor. If you're following this channel right now, we are on the journey of Kindle Direct Publishing. We are looking for passive income. We're looking for more time and freedom. So if that interests you, one, welcome to the community. You'll see a couple changes around here in, in the next coming weeks. I've renamed my community and a couple coaching products that I have. But in this video today, I wanted to share with you some of the benefits and kind of the four P's of pricing. And specifically, this video is when Amazon lowers your book price. A lot of people might get upset that they don't have control over the pricing of their book, but they kind of do. And we're going to dig into that right now. I'm going to share all the reasons why I love it. Let's go. All right. I put the three P's here. There's actually four. I'm spoiling the surprise for you. Number one, I love the perceived value that happens when Amazon puts my book on sale. So everybody loves a sale, right? But perceived value means <clears throat> people believe that they're getting more for less. And so anytime that you can do that, it, it, it works, right? It's like that home run. There are some people out there that will only, they have a perceived value, a core value. They will only buy something if it's on sale, which is so funny. You can probably think of things like I'll get that when it goes on sale, right? So that's number one, like perceived value happens when you see the original price and then there's a cut, a price cut, right? The second one, which I mentioned is that people love discounts. People love to feel like their money is going longer and further than it actually is. This might be a scarcity mindset thing, psychology. I haven't really dug deep into why people love discounts. Maybe I need to, but we know people love discounts. So that's a pretty straightforward number two. And number three is the profit. So this is why you should never get upset when Amazon is lowering the price of your book. When you upload your book and you put in the pricing, you get to control the royalties, right? You get to see. But on Amazon KDP, when Amazon lowers the price, it doesn't change for you in the back end. So that's pretty cool. But the thing that's the most important to me about this entire process of Amazon lowering the price is the fourth P. This is the bonus P and this is why I price my books high, right? This is, are you guys ready? Drum roll. Da, 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 da. I know I'm priced right. Amazon would not put my book on sale if Amazon did not believe that it would drive in more customers. Okay. So Amazon wants to sell my book and I've seen two, I should start screenshotting it, but Amazon has changed my price three times, three different discounts. And it has still been in the top 10 for its category. I don't know the ins and outs, but I'm trying to pay attention to that pricing to the numbers that it ends in, how long that pricing's there for, how much of a margin Amazon is willing to take. So I make that full royalty amount. So this is why I always encourage people to price their books higher. If they're selling well, like you can leverage this strategy. And I have raised the price of my book by $1 when it got into the top 10. And another thing that I feel like we could go down the hole on pricing, but one more thing before I end, if you do get a book to rank, look at the books around them, like in your top 50, look at what the prices is before and after. That always helps me price a book. 
And I really have no problem being a more expensive book. It's my job to describe the value. I put that in a previous video. It's in this playlist, Kindle Direct Publishing for Beginners. So don't be afraid to price your book in a way that Amazon also sees it as valuable and gives it a discount for their customers. Love you guys. Peace out.